Memphis a dreamer, a game of Sega. I'm on an island, it's not Jamaica. Shipping a package with different flavors. Playing the game, but I'm not a player. Probably with your triple layer. However you want, you'll get it later. I'm going up like an elevator. Wait, that's in the way. Uh, I'm not afraid. Uh, what you can say? Uh, I bust up the cave. Uh, Ernie and Jay. Uh, you get to my brain. Uh, memories fade. Healthy mammals on my Twitter page. What up, 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 Welcome to the Healthy Mop Kitchen, you know who the fuck it is. Today, I was blessed with a gift, pita chips. It came to my attention that there's no hummus, so I had the option of either buying hummus or creating hummus. Guess what we're gonna do? Some people like to count their blessings, Obi likes to count his chickpeas. A good amount to put in is like 15 grams, but if we're not talking 28 grams or more, then I don't wanna talk at all. So let's put 28 grams in this bitch. Yo, Obi, why are you crying? I'm gonna let you try this when we're finished. Everybody eats. Mm, that seems about not right. So right now, what we're doing is we're creating the base. If you didn't know, the base of hummus, garbanzo beans. Recommended, 15 grams. In the Healthy Mop Kitchen, it's 28 grams, no less. Once you get your 28 grams of garbanzo beans, you wanna add, mm, a tablespoon of organic Italian olive oil. This is the mob. You gotta talk like a mobster around here. Tablespoon, voila. You gotta concentrate on the beauty of the beans. It gives it more energy, which afterwards gives you more energy. You are gonna wanna add just a teaspoon of salt. Not too much salt because salt has sodium. Sodium afterwards turns into I don't know too much about sodium, but it can't be worse than cholesterol. Let's keep giving these garbanzo beans some energy, some love. Because what happens when you give love, it comes right back to you. That's why it's important to give more love than you receive. Because ultimately, if you do that, you're going to receive a lot more love. It's just how the universe works. I want to believe that most of you are more conscious than I am. But that consciousness only grows as soon as you go vegan. Before you put the lime in there, you gotta give it a massage, you feel me? Just like we're giving the garbanzo beans some love, you wanna give the lime some love. Invest some energy into it. This lime doesn't even know what's coming. It's like those cows in the slaughterhouses. The workers put them in there, and they're probably expecting to, you know, have some fun and shit, but nah, nah, nah. <laughs> this lime is up for a big surprise. He doesn't know what I'm about to do with this knife. Just like that, you cut the head off of the lime, and now the lime is dead. It must suck to be a lime, right? To go from a seed on top of a tree to being ripped off the tree and to be sliced open. That's the sad, true life of a lime. Now that the lime is officially dead, I'm just gonna squeeze this motherfucker in there. This is what gives that garbanzo that citrus excitement. Let's give it a little bit of pepper. Garlic is so fascinating. There's so many in this one little pot. Our creator did his thing. So here's our final step. Let's just add some garlic into this mix. So if you got your garbanzos in a can like this, it's cool to just add a little bit of water like that. Add as much as you think is right. Because you don't want to add too much. Definitely don't want to have too little. Our hummus is ready for creation. Let's just get the top. Sloppy toppy. In this case, it's not gonna be too sloppy, at least I hope. This is where dreams come true. This smells fucking icy. And by icy, I mean delicious. What I love about garbanzo beans is that it has six grams of protein. This is just one of many beans that has a lot of protein. So for those that are concerned about their protein intake, there's a lot of protein in this. It's time to munch out. These pita chips, by the way, no milk and uh, no dairy. Vegan. I'm in shock. I just made fucking hummus. This hummus is brought to you by AstroTope. If you're ever in a situation like me where somebody gives you a big bag of pita chips but you have no hummus, 
So instead of going out to buy hummus, put the ingredients together, throw this motherfucker in the blender, and bon appetit, healthy appetit.